I'm Robert Clinch. I'm a painter and printmaker. I'm about to do something quite different and that is paint an art car. My name is Jeff Brown and my father Joseph Brown was a very important part of the Australian art scene. He's regarded really as the doyen of Australian art. He was a, a maverick in the art world. We collect cars. When I say we, they don't include any my wife. We've got a couple of historic race cars and historic road cars. It wouldn't be many car collector people that have a deep interest in art and not many people have a deep interest in art who are car collectors. Many of Robert's paintings will illustrate some part of the urban environment and he'll often use paper darts to illustrate some element of the story that he's trying to show in his paintings. Paper darts have become a motif of mine that is adaptable to so many different kinds of subject matter. The word dart, I suppose, mostly describes a thing that you throw at a dartboard. The darts mean something that's related to fun for me. I think of paper planes as paper darts. And I enjoy seeing a simple piece of paper fly so well for such a distance. Dart just seemed to be a clever word for a tiny, good-looking little sports car. And it's a funny car. It's Australian made. And it's become an iconic thing around the world. Here we have flight in the darts coming together on a car which is a dart in the form of an art form. Darts are fun to me and it just fits in with the fun element of the gogo. -go. I said to Jeff, wouldn't it be funny to get a gogo -go mobile dart and paint paper darts all over the body like they were moving so that it created the sense of movement even when the gogo -go mobile dart is parked. We had the idea of painting paper darts on the gogo -go mobile dart so the, the thing would become an objet d'art. That is the canvas.